Greetings and thank you for the opportunity to come your way and spend a few moments in God's Word and pray together. This week, we're going to do something different, something we haven't done in the past. I want to deal with the, with the whole question about God and creation. And of course, we will address this in small bite-sized uh, you know, uh, four four minute uh, devotion. Now, it may be a little heavy for uh, devotion, but yet I think there will be some, some of us who like this this kind of uh, topic to be addressed, uh, just to strengthen our faith. So today, we're just going to talk about creation. The Bible tells us in Genesis chapter one, the very beginning, the very first verse. It says, "In the beginning." God created the heavens and the earth. So the Bible is very implicit, saying God always existed. God, he created, he brought into existence the heavens, this vast universe, this growing, expanding universe. He brought that into existence and also the earth, the planet that we are living in. And about God, Psalm 40 verse 28 says, Have you not known, have you not heard the everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, neither faints nor is weary, his understanding is unsearchable. So in this verse, we see at least these these three attributes of God. One, he transcends time. He is the everlasting God. He is, of course, the creator, the one who brought everything in existence. He neither faints nor is weary. There is no limit to his energy or power. And his understanding is infinite, is unsearchable, his intelligence or design. Now, when you look at creation, the first thing that many, or, or, or the whole issue or question around the question of creation is, what is the age? How, how old is this universe? And, Science over time has been changing their estimates. You know, there was a time when scientists told us that the Earth is about nine, or the universe is about nine billion years old. And today, the numbers stand around approximately, the universe is estimated to be about 14 billion years old. The Earth, about four billion years old. And yet, when we look at scripture, and the six days of creation and so on. And from there, we determine the the duration, the length of life on earth. We say, well, approximately 6,000 years and that or thereabout. But when there is this disparity of time, so when science uses its techniques of carbon dating and other ways to estimate time and says, this is 4 billion years old. And we say, no, It just happened maybe 6,000 years ago or so. What we must understand is this, that in the creative act of God, three things were compressed together. Time, energy, and design. All in an instant were compressed. God is outside time, is infinite. God is all-powerful, limitless energy. God's understanding is unsearchable, the absolute intelligence. And as creator, in a moment, he brought these three things together. And that's why in the creative act of God, time, energy, and design or intelligence was compressed in one instant. So what scientists may take tell us took billions of years, took a split moment in the creative act of God. And that's why we believe what the Bible says, God created. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for who you are and what your word reveals to us. And we worship you as creator God, that in an instant, time, energy, and intelligence was compressed together and released to form and create this amazing universe, this earth, 
life on earth. And we honor you, glorify you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.